Hi, welcome back to Talking Sense where we have real conversations about money and today we can have a real conversation about Christmas. Now December is here, Christmas is around the corner. What are you going to do? So this is about the do's and don'ts for Christmas, particularly to do with your money. Now there's just one of each. The do, have fun, for sure, have fun. The don'ts, don't spend money you don't have. That, that, that sums it up. And the two are very related. So have fun. If you have planned and have put the money aside, do whatever it is you have put the money aside, guilt free. If you have planned to go on holiday, go on holiday. If you've planned a party, have a party. If you planned an event at work, have an event at work. If you've planned uh, a lunch, have a lunch. Whatever it is you have planned to do and you put the money aside. Now, the, the problem comes when we start doing things last minute in Christmas that we never planned for. You didn't plan to buy gifts for all those people. Just because you bought them gifts does not mean you love them or couldn't buy them gifts doesn't mean you love them any less. So what can you do that's still having fun but without the pressure to buy gifts and to buy gifts of a certain nature that you know you cannot afford? Christmas is really about spending time with the people that we actually care about. So there are so many ways you can spend time with people without having to go into debt. It's time that you can also read a book learn something new, learn to cook, whatever it is that, but it doesn't mean you have to go and spend time at the bar spending money that you actually do not have. Do not take debt for anything for Christmas. If you are taking debt, it simply means that you cannot afford it. Do not try and do what other people are doing. If your neighbor is going on a holiday to Dubai. Do not also try to do that because your neighbor is going on a holiday to Dubai. Do what you can afford to do and what you have actually planned to do. So that's simple. Just don't spend money that you do not have because you know what? You know what comes after Christmas? January. And January comes with its whole set of expenses. Kids need to go to school. Life comes back to normal. Food needs to be bought. So don't get into this myth that we cheat ourselves temporarily that it's all about Christmas and having fun and there's no it's yolo let's not look out for tomorrow remember have fun but do what you can afford to do do what you have planned to do if you have not planned do what is manageable for your budget merry christmas